What's up everybody and welcome back to my channel. You know what time it is, so let's get into this photo challenge. For this month, I'm proposing you print your work. What I like to do is, I like to go to a specific area, as you know, and stay there or go back there over and over to see it in its many different lights or different times. I'll go before sunrise to catch the sunrise. I'll go midday to see that harsh light. And then I'll go for a sunset to see what that has to offer as well. You don't have to do what I do. You can do whatever you want to as far as your printing goes. Say there's some photos you took years ago that you always meant to have printed but you never did. Print them! Say you spent the holidays with family and you took some great shots. You want to be able to send them out to people. Print those. Whatever you want to print, just print it. It doesn't matter to me. The focus of this challenge is really to see your work in hand, to have the physical copy of your work. A lot of times in this digital age, we take photos with the intent of only posting the photos on Instagram or Facebook or Twitter. So you don't really have that whole experience of holding your photo in your hand, being able to examine it. And I think that's very beneficial to all photographers to be able to hold your work and look at it. So I keep my prints in a binder. Um, mostly 8x10s, 8 8.5x11s, 8 some of them, like very few of them. I've been playing around with uh, printing sizes just because, you know, a lot of times when I when I was initially starting to do the prints, I, I was printing them so that I could study them to see um, if I was hitting my focus, if I was um, exposing correctly. So I, I wouldn't actually edit these photos. I just would print them out just to see like kind of the shots that I got. Um, and what's great about it is I started printing these uh, back in 2018. January 2018 photos I had shot um, from the previous December and then throughout the year so for me it's fun to go back and see how far I've come if my style has changed if it's grown uh, if I was hitting exposure if I wasn't hitting exposure kind of reflecting on my journey the prints that I'm going to show you today I have I did the larger prints over the summer and some of the smaller prints I did in the fall from the summer. In the summer, I do spend a lot of time at the beach. I'm not even a water sign. I just really like water. But I spend a lot of time at the beach, specifically Santa Monica and Venice. I try to get to Venice whenever I can. There's something about the energy in Venice. I just love it. I enjoy the people. I know what to expect when I go, so I'm never disappointed when I go. I'm usually finding something new, so I spend a lot of time in Santa Monica and in Venice Beach last summer, and I'll probably spend a lot of time in Venice Beach this summer just kind of want to see growth and of course I'm going to print those photos as well I don't think I did I did do some prints of my last summer session in Venice Beach I seem to have a lot of track of where I put those but if I find them I will share them probably at the end of this summer when I have my prints from this upcoming summer together just to see um if my eye has kind of changed and what my interests are now versus what they were then because that's what I get out of my prints. I'm able to see um, if I'm progressing and where I'm progressing, what's catching my eye and what's not catching my eye and that kind of thing. So that's why I encourage you all to print your work as well just to have a starting point to say, oh wow, this is where, this is what I found interesting then. All right, so yeah, let's look at some of these other prints I've done. So this is a wall in my kitchen that I've started adding photos to. It's an ongoing project and by the end of the summer, hopefully, uh, I'll show it to you again and it'll be more full. These are all shot on 35mm cameras as well. This is a wall in my bedroom. This picture is a 24 by 36 and I really like it, but I couldn't keep the camera steady. So here is a photo of it right here. Um, I shot this at a sunrise in Santa Monica Pier. Um, like I said, the printout I did of it is a 24 by 36, and I shot this on my Olympus um, 35RC. And as you can see, it's very detailed and sharp, and I'm very happy with the results. This is the photo that's behind me right now in my work area. This is also a 24 by 36, also shot on the Olympus 35. Challenge yourself this month, you guys, and print your work. If you've already been printing your work, how long have you been printing your work for? Do you have 10 years worth of prints? If you haven't printed and this is your first time printing, let me know how it makes you feel, being able to have the hard copies of your work. And if you also decorate your apartment with your work, let me know too. All right, you guys, if you like this challenge and you like this video, please make sure you give it a like. If you haven't yet, please subscribe to the channel, and I will see you all in the next video. 
Peace.